Understanding. Stick one's chin out. A guide to bravery and risks. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase. Stick one's chin out. This expression is not only interesting but also packed with cultural and emotional nuances. Let's explore what it means, how to use it, and why it's important in communication. Stay with us to unlock another piece of the English language puzzle. Stick one's chin out is a figurative phrase that means to expose oneself to danger or criticism by acting boldly or offering an opinion. It's akin to putting yourself in a vulnerable position, where you're more likely to face opposition or risk. But why the chin, you might ask? The chin represents a part of the body that, when extended, suggests a posture of defiance or readiness to face whatever comes, much like a boxer might before a fight. This expression can be used in both personal and professional contexts. For example, in a meeting, if you stick your chin out by suggesting an unconventional idea, you're braving potential criticism for the sake of innovation. Socially, if someone sticks their chin out by standing up for what they believe in, even if it's unpopular, they're showing courage and integrity. It's most appropriate in situations where there's a clear risk involved with the action or opinion being presented. Let's see it in action with some examples. 1. Despite knowing he might be criticized, John stuck his chin out and voiced his concerns about the project's direction. 2. Mary stuck her chin out by defending her friend in front of their peers, despite knowing it could make her a target as well. These examples illustrate the phrase's use in everyday situations, highlighting the bravery or willingness to face consequences for one's actions or beliefs. Stick one's chin out is more than just a phrase. It's a testament to the human spirit's resilience and courage. By understanding and using such expressions, you enrich your English communication and connect more deeply with the nuances of human experiences. We hope this video helps you grasp the essence of this powerful expression. Remember, learning a language is not just about words, it's about understanding the stories and emotions they convey. Thank you for joining us, and we look forward to exploring more fascinating aspects of the English language together.